Welcome back everybody. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. In today's video, I'm going to be going over one combo from each season of Fortnite. So it's going to be a skin, back bling, pickaxe, glider, and also a wrap combo. So the skin is the only thing that needs to be from that particular season. And we're going to go through every single season of Fortnite. And I picked one skin for each of them. If you guys don't have these skins, I'm sorry, but these combos are still pretty cool. So for our first combo we have the season one combo with the recon expert the dual comma the death valley we have the mako glider of course and the gray toy wrap so I wouldn't say there's particularly anything very interesting, at least in the color scheme for this combo, but I love the Mako Glider with the Recon Expert. It feels like I'm some sort of OG. The wrap in this combo is very basic like the rest of it. It's just all gray. I didn't really find a better one than this, but I think it really matches up with everything in this combo. And then if we look at the Death Valley, it actually goes with every single color on the Recon Expert, including her skin color. The dual comma, it's just sort of there. It's nothing too special or crazy, but I actually really like it, and I think it fits right in with the Recon Expert. For the Season 2 combo, I felt like I had to use the Black Knight. I think this is the only Battle Pass skin combo I chose because I didn't want this to be solely about Battle Pass skins. If you guys would like to see a video like that, make sure to tell me, but we have the Black Knight, the Kylo's Cape, the Widow's Bite, we have the High Octane Glider as well, and then finally Finally, the wolf hunter wrap. So for everything in this combo, except for the back bling, everything has black and red in it. I just felt like I had to use this back bling because it looks so clean, especially on black skins. One other small detail I really like about this combo, you can find it with other pickaxes, like the axe pickaxe, if you guys know what I'm talking about, but there's this red ribbon wrapped around this pickaxe and it fits right in with the design of the Black Knight. He also has that red ribbon wrapped around his arm. I really don't know what that is or what that means or if it's just a small detail Epic Games likes putting on skins and other items out there, but I actually noticed a lot of different items with the red ribbon wrapped around some item out there regardless of what it is. I really like when the wraps stand out and that's why I chose this one. Overall, I really love this combo. You tell me what you think. We have the season 3 combo with the Midnight Ops that hasn't been in the shop for like 600 days. We have the Raven Pools Cage. We have the Big Bad Axe, the Hot Ride. Then we also have the Ultra Red Wrap. So similar to the Black Knight, everything in this combo is red and black, and I didn't try to do this for every combo, but I felt like the Hot Ride was decent with this one. You could go with some other gliders if you'd like to, but I just personally like the Hot Ride, and the color scheme matches up. I really hate this skin, but I like finding combos with skins I don't typically use, just to show that I can, but this one was not very difficult. I honestly scrolled through for about a few minutes, and I was able to find this whole combo. I feel like the big bad axe fits the design of this skin. You know, the big bad axe. This guy looks like a big bad, you know what I'm about to say. And then the back bling fits right in with this skin. I mean, this right here is a perfect combo in my eyes. Next up, we have the wrap that is pretty basic, just red and black, but again, fits right in. For my season four combo, we have the hazard agent, the puncture pack, the skull sickle. We have the meltdown glider. And then finally, we have have the zesty wrap so typically for a glider i'm not going to want to use it if it's in the same set as the skin i try not to use items that are in the same set but i really couldn't find a different alternative so i went with the same set glider as the skin in this one instance i really love how this back bling has the same color scheme as the skin but it also has a lot of other details going on with it so it doesn't match up perfectly with the skin it actually draws your eyes attention to the back bling which i absolutely absolutely love. And then obviously the tip of the pickaxe, the teal part fits with the skin, but the black handle also fits with the black color scheme the skin has. Again, I couldn't find a color scheme that worked with this skin. It is sort of weird. It's got a teal color scheme that not too many things have in this game. That's why this combo is so impressive to me and why I like it so much. It's very different. A rule of thumb I have, if the wrap isn't going to work perfectly, if you can't find that perfect color scheme, 
match, go with something a little bit crazier, and that's what I did here. For our season five combo, we have the Scorpion with the uplink, we have the Harley hitter, we have the Founders Glider as well, and then to end it off, we have the Greed Wrap. So for this combo, guys, I went with something that was very small for everything. We have the Founders Umbrella here. I don't know if I said Glider earlier. I probably did. But the back bling is small. It fits right in. And then the pickaxe is also small, but I would say it fits right in. I really do like the smaller pickaxes, and I know a ton of people had this one, so I wanted to add it in. And I would say it fits pretty well with this skin combo. If you guys are looking for an army design, this one is it. And, I mean, she's holding a bat, too. So same thing as the last combo. The wrap, I couldn't find that perfect match with it, but I would say this one works well enough. It's definitely not my favorite wrap that could have been placed on with this one, but I don't know if another one exists that works with this skin combo. For our next combo, we have the Insight, the Dark Hatchling, we have the Thunder Crash, we also have the Rainbow Rider, and finally the Kevin Wrap. I know a lot of people have the Rainbow Rider, and I think it's a perfect match. You guys are gonna have to tell me what you think. But I know I'm gonna get a lot of comments saying, hey, the Thunder Crash actually doesn't work, but I would say it does. So it has all the same color scheme as the skin, but the red is red on the pickaxe, and the pink is pink on the skin. Those are the only two differences there. I love how I'm able to use an edit style of a skin and the secondary edit style of a back bling to make this combo work. And the teeth have a little bit of white, and the back bling also has a little bit of white, so I think that matches up there. And for the wrap, I chose the Kevin wrap, guys. I absolutely love this wrap, and I think it looks pretty good with this combo. For our Season 7 combo, we have the Lace with the Coral Commandos. We have the Snack Attackers. We also have the Tie-Dye Glider and the Kitsune Wrap. I love when I'm able to make a combo that's a little bit unorthodox, but this one, I, I would say it's probably my favorite this video. The Tie-Dye Glider, it obviously has a lot of the same colors as the skin in the rest of this combo. It might not be a perfect match, but it's gotta be colorful. This secondary lace edit style is one of my favorite skins in this game. I love the color scheme of the back bling, and these pickaxes literally fit right in. This is one of those more colorful combos, but I would say it is still a sweaty combo if you guys would like to try it out. The back bling isn't too big, the skin isn't too big, and the pickaxes aren't too big as well. So for the wrap, guys, I would say it might have a little bit too much black on it that I don't necessarily love. The white, the pink, and the gold color scheme literally match up with this skin so perfectly, guys. This one, even if you want to switch up the back bling and the pickaxe, it's still going to work so well with this skin, the wrap is. For the season 8 combo, we have the supersonic, the Night Cloak, the Banana Axe, we have the Classified Umbrella, and the Clockworks Wrap. Out of every combo in this video, I would say this one is the best in terms of the color scheme matching up perfectly. The gold and black color schemes throughout the whole thing work out perfectly. Nothing is too bright or too dull. It's all the same color. This is one of my favorite skins, and I would say this is my favorite edit style of the Supersonic. Guys, I love this combo. I really want to see this one tried out by you guys. And then for the wrap, it is a little bit more detailed than the rest of this design. Obviously, that's how Epic Games does it for most wraps. But the color scheme works out just fine. The gold and the black fits right in with this combo. For our next combo, we have the Tempest, the Indigo Wings. We have the Ultra Scythe. We have the Dark Glimpse Glider as well, which I know all of you guys have. And then the Gemstone Wrap. If there are two choices between gliders, and I know one is more popular, like the the dark glimpse, then I'll choose it for your guys' sake. Because I do like making combos for items that I think at least a decent amount of you guys have. This is one of those combos where it's like, wait, did these items come out in the same set? But to find out that they don't come out in the same set is sort of mind-boggling to me. I don't get how that happens, how they work so well together. And then for the wrap, I feel like it's the common denominator for these combos. The wraps are just pretty weird. They're all pretty crazy. Not all of them fit in perfectly. I could have used the Kevin wrap again, but I didn't want to use it in two combos. That's not what I like to do. So if you guys feel like the Kevin wrap would work better with this combo, feel free to use it, guys. For the Season X combo or Season 10 combo, we have the Zorgaton, the Bag of Shadows, we have the Volt Batons, we have the Hard Shell Glider as well, and then finally the Festive Paper. Okay, it's called the 
half shell glider. Okay, I thought it was hard shell. My bad, guys. But as you guys can see, it fits right in with this combo. I've got to say the highlight for this combo for me is the skin and the back bling. I don't know why these two items work so perfectly together, but they really do. The pickaxes may be a different color scheme, but I would say four pickaxes. I sort of like when they do stand out at least a little bit similar to the wrap. So even though they're not the same color scheme, I think it's a good addition to this combo that they're not. They draw your eyes and they draw the attention, and I love pickaxes, so I like when that happens. And then finally, the festive paper, I would say, works out fairly well. Again, the common denominator is the wrap. It's not absolutely perfect, but it's pretty good. For our chapter 2 season 1 combo, we have the complex, we have the back bling, I don't know how to pronounce, the star wand, the windbreaker as well, and then finally, the carnival flowers wrap. I would say out of any combo out there, my favorite to make are the very colorful combos. The windbreaker has a ton of colors that match up with this skin and back bling. I really do like how the star wand is two colors. I mean, it does have that wrap around it that has a few more colors, and those colors may even match up with this skin, but the pink and yellow do match up with this skin at least a little bit. This is a combo I like using and I have used in the past without this back bling, but the back bling is so colorful that I had to use it with this skin. And then finally for the wrap, another very colorful one that changes colors as you shoot it. I had to use this one for this combo, guys. Tell me what you think about it. I love the colorful combos. For our chapter two, season two combo, we have the Envoy, the Streamline back bling, the Merry Mint Axe. We have the Pivot Glider, and then finally the Stealth Black Wrap. So for this combo, I like to think of myself as a secret agent. The one thing that stands out for this combo is the pickaxe, and I actually really like that about it. I mean, I'll use the Merry Mint Axe with any skin. This one isn't that far-fetched in my eyes. If you guys want to go look for a better pickaxe, there are plenty of other options that are very good for you to use, but I personally love the Merry Mint Axe, and I wanted to add it to this combo. And then for the wrap, I just went with the all-black wrap since nothing else was really working. This one fits in very perfectly, I would say. So guys, tell me what you thought about the combos in today's video. Did you love them? Did you hate them? Make sure to tell me in the comment section. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys could, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, turn on those notifications as well. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.